Greetings and salutations, gamers. This is John the Gamer 64 coming at you with a new limited run games unboxing video. So, this is going to be a pretty good episode. This is actually going to be part of the blowout sale of 2023. So, these are just a couple of the items I picked up from Limited Run. So, it's going to be a little mystery bag for you. So. Yeah, I'm actually waiting on a couple more, maybe like two more games, I think. So I did go kind of ham uh, as far as the blowout sale was concerned. So, yeah, let's do it. So this is game number one here. Oh, there we go. Let's see, let me run forever physical. So they actually do have like uh, what's called a blind box, but this is my version of it. Like, I know what I got, but... <laughs> For you guys, since you don't see, since it's inside the uh, packaging or the bubble mailer, you don't know what it is. So it works out. All right, here we go. Oh, crap. Hold on. Yeah. Almost got it. Okay, cool. So, we got a PS4 game. This is called Senko no Ronde 2. So, yeah, it has like a it's like an anime aesthetic here. <laughs> Pretty sure it's not based on an anime, but hey. So, this was quite interesting. The reason I got this one is because it was like a mix of like a fighting game and a shoot 'em up. I guess you could put it so yeah, it's like a mix of like fighting games and bullet hell shmups, which I found pretty interesting. I'm like, okay, we'll definitely uh, give this one a go. All right, so game number one. This is game number All right, this one was definitely an arcade game that I really wanted on Switch, but fortunately, that one sold out pretty quick. So, settled for the PS4 version. So, the game is Windjammers. There, there you go. Aha, all right. So, yeah, uh, this was an interesting arcade game that was only released on the Neo Geo MVS back in the arcade. So it was like this sweet little fris frisbee game, and man, this game is definitely, definitely a blast. What I played on it, I actually played this on my little Miu Mini. So, yeah, pretty happy to have this. I seen they made a sequel, but like for some reason, I am not digging the art style. But they, I think the only, only exceptions was like. Uh, Streets of Rage 4, which looks amazing. But I don't know. Windjammers 2, like, I'm not really a fan of the graphics so far, but I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. Not to say I wouldn't play it. I mean, because Windjammers has some fantastic gameplay for sure. Uh, what the fuck? <laughs> Did they send me a double copy? What? What in the hell? No, I didn't order two copies. Well, that's uh, hmm, strange. Well, I'm gonna have to check my uh, <laughs> limited run games account because I'm pretty sure I only ordered one copy. Okay, and the last game we got is the Gal Gunvolt Burst with Mighty Number no. Nine, which wasn't a bad game. I don't know why people gave Mighty Mighty Number no. Nine so much crap, but I thought it was a decent game. But I've always wanted to play the Gunvolt series, so hey, we'll mix some Mighty Number no. Nine, some chick named Ekoro, and Gunvolt.
All right. Now on to some gameplay footage. Uh, still crazy, dude. Why do I have two copies of Windjammers? <laughs> well, I know I'm waiting on two more games, so hopefully they don't think like, oh, yeah, we already sent you your other game. I'm like, no, you didn't. But, yeah, we'll see what's going on with that situation. Alrighty, folks. Uh, so I just realized that I didn't actually unbox or unwrap the games here. So let's go ahead and uh, do just that. Check out the manual, whatever else they packed in here. Okay, so we're going to open the Senku no Ronde 2 first. Uh. go all right so it's got a <laughs> not even a manual it's like a two-page leaflet really it's almost like they kind of trolled you on purpose so like, oh, you're expecting a manual psych <laughs> well it does have a reversible cover it looks like so that's cool. All right, all right. I guess this one didn't come with the limited run uh, card. Usually most, if not all, orders came with a card. Okay, well, that's that one. So let's check the Gal Gun Vault's burst. All right. See, so yeah, this is the back. All good stuff. Yep, somewhat of a manual. A little better than the last one, for sure. So, yeah, at least uh, introduces the characters of the game, so that's, that's something. <laughs> Bray. Yep, Copen. Okay. I think this one has a reversible cover too. Or not quite. It's just uh <clears throat> just the background. That's pretty much it. Okay, and the last game. Well, unbox. Wind jammers. Wind jammers. And the disc fell out. Great sign. <laughs> this this is still in good condition. No scratches from what I can see. Luckily. <laughs> Alright, okay. <clears throat> so we got six unique characters in this tiny little manual. Oh there we go. Okay, so they teach you how to play the game and everything. Make a lob. Super throw. Yada yada yada. So that's cool. Now this is more of a manual than the last one. <laughs> or not the gunvolt one. I mean the gunvolt one was okay. It was the one before that. The freaking Cinco Noronde 2. But hey, at least I got them physical, so it's not too bad. Okay, I mean, it's cool. At least they made Windjammers physical. So in case you never got to play in the arcades or can uh, buy the arcade cab, which is probably like thousands of dollars or something. Okay, now on to the gameplay footage. Alrighty, folks. And the first game we're doing gameplay footage for is the Senko no Ronde 2. Uh, so I guess this is based on an anime for when I hear so on the back of the box it says, oh, a drama-packed SF scenario featuring classic art from the series. And I'm guessing they actually did make an anime out of this. But anyways, without further ado. Ooh. Kind of looks like an Earth colony from Gundam here. It's pretty neat. No, really? Not found? 
It's a brand new game. All right, can mess with the tutorial right quick. Okay, armory gauge, yada yada yada. Grabability of rounder. Charge gauge required for barrage attacks in your barrier. Da, da, da. Okay. Number of times boss mode is available, you gain one or more if you lose around. And look at the bottom screen. If there is a beast stack, you'll need the for boss modes and bombs. Uh-huh. Yep, yep. When the time counter reaches 20, your armor gauge will automatically deplete itself. Vanish mode. Goes around if you take another hit. Da -da -da. Mm hmm Digging your own grave, yada yada yada. Okay, let's talk piloting. Do a dash. Tilt the left stick and press the dash button R2. Okay. Alright. That should do a quick turn or two quickly. Okay, dash button, mid dash, stop abruptly, you can perform the next move without any delay. Press the dash and then stop. Yada yada. Okay, let's skip that. Can we just skip that? See, I don't get it. Press the dash button. Oh, okay. Yep. Never mind. I was <laughs> I just really want to get to the action already. That's why I'm like trying to like finish the tutorial quick here. I have two other games to play, so. Alright, technical defense, fire me weapon. The barrage attack launches a powerful attack with bullets. Barrage attacks will use up your charge gauge. Okay, put up your barrier, blah blah blah. If you can take a hit with your barrier up, your charge gauge will decrease. When the gauge is empty, your barrier will be out of the Oh, 
最後にバリア中も攻撃できるかを覚えておきますバリア中は攻撃できるかを覚えておきますOh, attack with your barrier up. Okay. Gotcha. Gotcha. Okay, abilities. Yeah, there we go. When the sign here is lit, that means you're ready to use an ability. Activate ability, so L1 or square and okay. Watch the light. Okay. Okay, is this the end yet? <laughs> Yeah, melee combat, okay. You have two types of melee attacks. Uh, okay, cool, cool. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's get over the tutorial already. Best thing about the melee is drain your enemy's gauge too. Da -da -da -da. バリアで守っている敵には、エスキンセツ攻撃が有効。覚えておいて。最後にMS同時押しの通称バレットキャンセラーは定時範囲に関係なく、いつでも好きに出せるのよ。やってみて。バカだ。音声。その調子。この攻
or L2, yeah, there we go. Definitely an interesting concept, making a shoot 'em up slash fighting game. That's everybody's trading. Good work, hon. Okay. Good. <laughs> Ten minutes later. Jeez Louise. Alright, guess we'll do arcade. Yeah, okay. We're not gonna change any of the settings, we're just gonna play as is. Alright, so let's check out the characters here. Vesma. Huh? <laughs> different costume. Chrysoberl? Chris Chrysoberl. Sakuraku Sakuraku Interesting Definitely some cool looking designs here okay, That one is just... Huh, okay Interesting cast of characters here One skimpier than the other. He. <laughs> hmm. Decisions. Has like the cool like cum laude hat right there. All right, go with this feet. Yeah, pick a co-pilot. Guess so. Alrighty. Finally getting to it. Hashim. Oop, boss mood. Oh, snaps. Okay. Mission death. <laughs> hmm. Digging this dude so far. Or his mech at least. <laughs> Oh, 
Alright. Woo, level five. Awesome. Alright. So I think I'll make this the last match and then we'll move on to the next game. Whoa. <laughs> this freaking like boomerang thing like shoots bullets. It's pretty dope. Oh crap. Kamehameha! Huh, <laughs> the boss defeated you. <laughs> okay, this dude is too cool. Oh, whoa, that, that was sick. That's a little sword slash there. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Getting a little too crazy there, are we? Boss mood. Ha ha ha. Time to die. Time to die. Oh, yeah, actually beat the boss, okay. Alrighty. Yeah, this dude's pretty cool. This uh, freaking ninja mech <laughs> with the Kung Lao hat. It's kind of cool. Almost kind of reminds me of Virtual On, like if it were shoot 'em up. But yeah, it's freaking awesome. All right, definitely a good purchase for sure, man. All right, so we're gonna move on to the next game. Alrighty, folks, on to the next game here. So that game is the Gal Gunvolt Burst. Alright. Yeah, so I guess it's going to be my first uh, Gunvolt game. I mean, even those ones, I guess like a crossover with Mighty Number no. 9 and the, the girl from that Gal Gun series, which was like kind of weird Japanese pervy schoolgirl affair. Oh yeah, anything that's like Mega Man, I'm gonna freaking love, <laughs> regardless. Alright, so let's go ahead and start the game. You are now able to select a new playable character. Alright, so we got Beck, Gunvolt, Ikoro. Oh yeah, she's from Mighty Number no. Nine. Not sure about her. Definitely from Mighty Number no. Nine. And some Otaku nerd. <laughs> uh, let's see. Who do we go with? I do want to play as Ray at some point, but I think I'll go with Gunball. New type of supernatural substance. Septimal power has emerged. Massive conglomerate known as Sumeragi. Group set out to bring all the adepts, those who possess three powers, under control. Blah, 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 adored by Gunvolt, a young man with a septimal power of lightning. After his battle with Sumeragi. However, a new source of turmoil on adepts. Okay. While on a mission one day, Gunvolt witnessed a strange glimmer. I had a bad feeling about this, but it was already too late. Eyes begin to adjust. And... 
Alrighty, let's do it. <laughs> it's almost kind of has like a Game Boy feel here. <laughs> Strawberry. I already feel at home with this game, because <laughs> it's definitely like Mega Man. <laughs> Destroying enemies when you're up close to personal creates a magnificent explosion. It's called Burst. It's not just for show. Each burst will increase your score. Both on first combo. Okay. Apples, okay. Oh, like I don't know how to climb a ladder. Being how this is definitely a Mega Man game, like Mega Man style game. Like, oh, learn how to climb a ladder. Like, really? Most well, people who are like brand new to the series and never played Mega Man, okay. SP, yada yada yada. All down skills. Besides this Astrosphere. Da -da. All snaps. Oh, that's pretty cool. Ah, oh, come on. Oops, oh, a boss, I see. Invincibility. So close. Ah, we got control, baby. This is fun. Oh, boss door. Here we go. Quickly add, equip, blah, blah, blah. Good to know. Okay, you failed health, we're good. Oh, snaps, okay. Looks crazy there. Oh, crap. She's in the face. Whoa, whoa, bouncy. Alright, come on. Can die now. Defeated. Stage clear. Welcome to the VR world. Looks like the kid that takes care of that. Let's see where we go next. <laughs> Is that a boy? Nope, it's a robot. Careful, GB. Got a bad feeling about this one. 
Nice to meet you. My name is Beck. Oh, mighty number nine. Just had goggles on. They don't remember the, the mighty numbers. I'm here to tell you that you're gonna have to participate in the super mighty battle showdown. You're up against my robo siblings. Should you defeat them, they'll take on a raging champ. Me. See ya. That was an odd introduction. Gonna have to play along. Yeah, no penalty. Woo! Thanks to this robot boy named Beck, I was forced to become a participant in the robot battle tournament. Heard, heard martial arts tournaments, but this is the first robot versus human one I've seen. At any rate, I like to see I will be able to freely use my powers. Ever since we got there, Joel. Uh, uh, All right, raise your maximum CP by 300. Complete challenge. Complete challenge. Go to challenge. Uh, 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 uh. Okay, a bunch more levels, let's see. Okay, um, I think I'm going to go ahead and go on to the last game here, which is the uh, Wind Jammers. So, yeah, there you go. It's uh, one stage of a uh, Gunvolt, <laughs> Gal Gunvolt Burst. So yeah, on to the final game, Windjammers. Alrighty folks, and we are on to Windjammers. Pretty dope Neo Geo arcade game for sure. Okay, the local game here. Alright, arcade. We've got so you play dog distance or flying power disc bowling. Interesting. Versus challenge your friends and local versus. Okay. Just gonna do arcade real quick. We get easy. Just do medium for now. H Mita Klaus Weisel Klaus Weiselheimer Whoa It's flashy uh Oh Whoa Okay All crazy there Woohoo! Oh, he caught it. Up, oh, still got him. Still got him. It's like a really extreme game of Pong here. Love it. Boo. Hold on. Let's check out. Oh, I guess. Gotta check the options menu beforehand. Woo! Yeah. <laughs> This game is so fun. Whoop. Woo! Aw, oh, damn it. That was intense. Oh, come on. No. Yeah, he lucked out. Oh, cheap, 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 cheap. I'm so glad I have this game though. <laughs> Why not switch? Yeah. Whoa. Okay. Not too crazy there. Ah! Oh. 
Oh, damn it. <laughs> Come on. Oh, come on. Lube. What a fool doing. Alright, I'll try the other modes right quick. Mini games. Dog distance. Dog distance or bullet. Well, I'll try both. Why not? You guys deserve it. Let's go with S. Miller. Wee! Oh wait, I'm playing as a dog? No way. That's a unique minigame. Is that even the original arcade game? Forget. I don't really remember it. Jump over the babes. This game is so transically 80s. Fuck! Oh. Oh uh, yeah, that's how that went. All right, flying this bowling. Ah, okay. Trick shot it. Definitely an interesting mode for sure. Finally got a strike. Yeah. Wait, I don't play the full 10 frames? What kind of crap is that? <laughs> Half ass bowling, it's more like. Okay, check out the game settings. Oh, got the scan lines, that's always cool. There we go. That's what I like, full screen, baby. Alright, one more time, one more time. Oh, facing my doppelganger. Hey, what the hell? This ain't full screen. Freaking liars. Sure, I made that abundantly clear. Klaus Wessel again. There we go, that's a full screen I like. Yeah, there we go. Own you, sucker. Oh, okay. Oh, I oh, still got him. <laughs> This is like the most epic frisbee game I ever played. Damn, I'm owning him so hard. Take that close whistle. Would you like a pretzel?
Ah, okay, that was dumb. I'll let you have those two points, okay. Hey, he injured me with that. That's allowed? Gee. <laughs> oh, I hate him too. Yes, yeah, sucker, what's up? Whoop. Whoop. Crap. Okay. Uh oh. Whoa. Damn it. Thought I had that right there. Oh, stupid. No. <laughs> Woo! Got him. <laughs> this game's so fun. Oh, it's okay, I'll let you have those. Don't worry about it. It's all good, man. Oh, stupid. Oh, God damn it! No! Stupid. Stupid! Ah, okay. Alright, you know, getting better at it, for sure. Better than the last time. Alrighty, folks. That about covers it for this limited run games unboxing for the blowout sale of 2023. So thank you all for watching and peace out.